So I was scrolling through my Instagram feed, looking for new ideas for my next project. And then suddenly, I came across this amazing scene from the movie Nightmare Alley. It was just so captivating that I knew I had to recreate it in Blender. The next step was to create a reference. I wanted to make sure that my artwork had the same vibe and atmosphere as the original scene, but at the same time, I wanted to put my own spin on it. So I took some of the elements from the scene and combined it with my own ideas and created a unique scene. With my reference sketch in hand, I opened up Blender 3D and began creating my base sketch. So I started by adding a plane. After adding the plane, I subdivided it 40 times. After that, I imported a window asset, scaled it down and moved it upwards above the plane and duplicated it. Now for the wall, add a plane, scale it down and delete the middle vertices for the windows. After that, add a camera, select the frame, then in view, select align view, then align camera to active view. This will position your camera to the selected frame. After that, I imported a couch asset and placed it in front of the window. I have also imported a character of man sitting on a couch according to my reference. Now set the render engine to cycles and device to GPU compute. After that, I added a cube and scaled it. Then in the shader editor, I added a new material, deleted the principal PSDF and added a principal volume node. In that, I have set the density to 0.01 and anisotropy to 0.7. Now for the lighting, I have added a point light and placed it outside the cube behind the window. And after that, I have increased the intensity of the light. Now I have changed the light color to orange so that it looks more cinematic. Then I duplicated the light and placed it behind the second window. Now for the materials, I am using an add-on blender kit. I have added a tile texture to the plane. And then in the UV editor, I scale down the texture so that it looks more realistic. Now I have added the girl character which is the final asset in our scene. I have scaled it down and placed it in front of the man sitting on the couch. As you can see, I was able to take my inspiration from the scene in Nightmare Alley and create my own unique version in 3D. And here is the final render. Do some color grading and appreciate your work. Thanks for watching. Also don't forget to like and subscribe for more content like this. You can also follow me on Instagram at Visuals where I post some amazing cinematic visuals.